This is going to demonstrate how you can use Stochus to control another instance of Stochus in Reaper. In this case, what I'm going to be controlling is battery with the old Jazz kit. Before that in line, I have Stochus set up with three drum patterns, one, two, three, and three drum fills, four, five, and six. You can see that I've labeled my notes according to battery. Under MIDI mapping I'm using the default settings. Change pattern 1 through 8 are assigned to MIDI messages C-2 through G-2. Before that in my chain I have another instance of Stokos which has MIDI notes C minus 2 through F minus 2 and I've labeled these here pattern 1, 2, and 3 and then fill 1, 2, and 3. You can see that what it's going to do is it's going to play randomly between these three patterns for the first three measures and then it's going to randomly select one of the fills for the fourth measure. see this white bar here it tells you which pattern it's on. It's going to do three measures of the first three. setup of this is going to vary between hosts. In Reaper it's very easy. You simply put one instance after the other instance on the chain. In other hosts you might need to map the MIDI or route the MIDI between channels to get this to work. 